Get hotter, it's going to get stickier, and it could get stormier later in the afternoon into the evening hours here. Uh, these are the highs from today, 85, jumped it up quite a bit from yesterday, 72. Lots of 90s from Chicago and Milwaukee out here to the west, and those are trying to get closer to us tomorrow with some extra humidity, and that both can fuel storms, of course. Outside right now, it's down to 70 in Lapeer. Same thing in Port Huron. Well, it's still 79 in Troy, 75 in Monroe, Detroit, and 79 in Adrian. So differs quite a bit. Upper 60s for you now in Ann Arbor. Just a few clouds around, not too many. Temperatures here at the 10 o'clock hour are generally 10 or so degrees warmer uh, than it was the same time yesterday. And we'll keep that upward trend going through tomorrow. Pull back a little bit, then the really big heat comes in early next week. So a few clouds going by here tonight. Storms out in northern Wisconsin. Some of those showers that as they fizzle, they'll turn into just showers. Might get to the Saginaw Valley, the tip of the thumb, probably not the metro area. And then more development on the back of that. And that's what could get here late in the day tomorrow. And that could be, again, a problem. It doesn't have to be, but it's about a 30%, 40% chance for some showers and storms around, and some of those might get a bit strong. So here's a look at future cast as we run through tomorrow. Uh, we stop it here at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. At that point, not much going on, but watch the development between 4 and 6, between 6 and 8, between 8 and 10. You get the idea. It'll be kind of hit and miss action, but it still has the potential to be an issue. The big bullseye, I think, will be Illinois into and through northern Indiana with two different waves there. And most of that should stay just off to our south. So I think by about midnight or so, we're probably done. Uh, if there's some leftover action, fine. Uh, we'll be here all night one way or another to watch it for you, but it shouldn't be a huge issue once we get past midnight. Here's what it's going to feel like tomorrow, 4 o'clock, 92 in Detroit, 93 in Monroe, 92 in Mount Clemens. That's, of course, the combination of the heat and humidity, the heat index. And then next Tuesday, it'll feel like 97 to 100 across the area in the afternoon. On Wednesday, about the same kind of a feel here. So some serious heat coming for building up Sunday on Father's Day. But Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday next week, it'll be hot and sticky. 67 for a low tonight, partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow, uh, storm chances increase, especially late in the day. 89 in Detroit, but again, it feels like about 92. Nice day Friday, nice day Saturday. Sunday's the good for Father's Day, although the heat starts picking back up. And then 94 to 92 Monday, Tuesday, Ooh. and Wednesday of next week. Wow.